Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new Minecraft series. That tree is still on fire. Um this is a brand new mod pack. Well, it's not brand new. Um I played this a little bit before. This is Technode Firmacraft. Um this is a pretty complex mod. It uses Terra Firmacraft, which completely redoes Minecraft. My FPS is going to be a little bit low for this. Um, just give me one sec. I'll drop render distance a little bit more. Um, as you can see, I've got settings kind of low. Um, this mod pack is a little bit taxing on my FPS, unfortunately. Um, I'm going to play this a little bit and see how it goes. Um, I have done a little bit. I've survived the first night. Um, sorry that you didn't get to see that. That's why there's a fire over there. Um, but yeah, I needed to get a couple things really, really quickly. Um, this water jug being one of them. Um, as you can tell, down at the bottom, I have a lot more health and hunger. And there's a blue bar, which is water. Um, these are all what I need to survive in this new world. Um, if I come in here to this quest line, it will start explaining stuff. Um, as you can see, the first couple ones are already done. Um, we have to collect, in this mod pack, um, we have to collect sticks and we have to collect stones. Um, these are both just lying on the ground. You see, yeah, see, here's, here's a stick. You just right click that and a stone. Pick those up. Um, and then we use these in order to make our tools. So we'll go right ahead, claim this reward. Um, I do only have so many lives. I only have 20 lives. Um, so we're going to try really hard not to die. Um, and then we have this one, which is making an axe head and making an axe. Um, we're going to take the basalt because I can. Um, and we need to make a spear next. And we get some javelin heads and some other hand tool heads too, which will be nice. Um, and then there's other things we need to make, like a fire starter and torches. And I'll start explaining stuff as I go. Um, but one of the most basic things we need, if, once, if you have more than one stone, you can right click and this interface comes up. And then you click on the squares to make your tools. There's a zombie. Crap. And as you can see, I just made a couple knife blades. And then you just take your tool head, put it in your crafting bench with a stick, and it will make your tools. Um, the knife is the most basic tool, and you need it to collect stuff like the seaweed, which is what I'm currently using for food. So, yeah. Um... I spawned in a forest, which is not particularly great for um, this mod pack. Um, but I did find this small place over here. As you can see, those trees are burning down because of a fire I made in the night. Um, but I think over here is probably the best bet to set up base that I can find for now. Um, it's actually in the open, kind of. These trees are burning down, unfortunately, but we can fix that. Um, also, breaking leaves with a knife can give you either um, sticks or saplings, depending. So hopefully we can get a sapling out of these before they all burn down. Um, there's also straw, which we get from gathering um, grass, which can be used to make other things. Um, something very important about this mod, besides everything pretty much um is blocks will fall so if we're not careful the block we like any structure we make can just fall over S but certain materials won't so i'm gonna claim these get these lives real quick get them out of my inventory um and as you can see you need a water jug in order to actually get water and you get it from fresh water which has these cattails coming out of it it's a very, very complicated mod, to say the least. Um, probably the wiki is the best place to get information for it. Um, but this book appears to explain a lot about it as well. So, 
Um, I'm going to go ahead and make a javelin head right now so that we can claim this reward. So we just need to nip these, get a javelin head. We throw that up here with a stick like this. And this is how you make pretty much all of your tools. So we'll grab that. We will claim the reward in our book. which So a javelin, a knife, and then a hammer we're supposed to make. So we get rid of this top one. Um, is it just the bottom one? There we go. There's the hammer. So basically, if you just make the basic shapes, um, it works. I'll show you all of them. If not in this episode, in this one and the next one, you'll see all of them. Um, I want another knife blade because that's important. Um, ooh, we can get seeds. That's awesome. Farming will be very useful. Um, and then there's this, which is um, pottery, which is for clay. Um, that's how I made the water jug. And actually, if I knew I could just claim this reward, I might have done that. But I didn't know that. So, um, But yeah, these things are made the same way except with clay. And you need, I believe, five clay in order to make one. Um, again, sorry about the low FPS. Um, I don't know how long this series is going to go for. Um, it will probably just depend on how long I live and how long till my FPS just completely tanks. So um, this is a pretty high maintenance pack. So. Um, I found some clay over here. I want to gather that up real quick. Yeah. Um, clay, like you can see it spawning here in, with dirt. Um, you need to find these um, these plants, these gold norum. What is that? Gold and ro golden rod. That's it. Um, if you can find these golden rods, there's clay underneath them, um, whether it's dirt or sand or whatever. Um, I believe. Okay, those, that didn't fall. Um, blocks will fall depending on what they are. So I'm just going to gather up a bunch of clay because we're going to need a lot of clay. I want to get away from these fires. Um, hopefully getting away from these fires will help my FPS because it is just bad over here. Wow. All right, let's get back over to base and I'll show you guys a few more things. Um, I'm not sure how long this first episode's going to be. Probably just long enough to get things settled and set up. So, um, where's the sun at? past midday which is not good night is a horrible time in this mod pack um i barely survived it so okay and then we need to, we already made that when you make a bowl and a clay vessel as well it is getting dark very quickly we're gonna start a fire we'll actually start it down here um so to start to get a fire pit no we need to throw some sticks on the ground. Come on. There we go. And now we have a fire pit. So if we throw some a stick in here, it will turn into a couple torches. And this is how we um, cook food and, like I am showing you here, make torches. I think we can make charcoal. No, we can't. But um, you just throw a log over here, it will light it back up, and yeah. So we've got some torches, so let's go ahead, take some of these block, take some of these, turn them into cobblestone, and set up a few over here. Now we're not going to, see just like that. There's an example of something falling. We're not going to be able to pick these up for a little bit, so we need to be careful about placing them. Um, these logs we could place better. And actually, this is acacia wood, which is interesting. I didn't actually realize what kind of wood this was. Um, but yeah, we're going to stick out over here and hope that nothing really spawns. Stuff might spawn over there, but hopefully if we just stick out 
here through the night will be safe ish um and i can show you other stuff so um we can't really do much at night like i've said before um so we're going to concentrate on making tools and um making pottery so we'll let's see so we can go ahead claim this reward which is good get some more wood got another heart turn that in right away all right so pottery all right so um we want a clay vessel which is this we want a clay bowl which is getting rid of all of these and there's some clay bowls and that will give us this well almost this then a large vessel um i believe we can make this it should just be removing this stuff yep large vessel all right and then we need to um turn m m cook them basically is what we need to do so we need wood and we need the straw but we don't have enough straw you need eight wood and you need eight um straw in order to cook up the pottery so just grab this real quick um and then you'll notice that i have this hole here so we'll take well actually we should probably you can do four things in one here. Um, if you hold shift and right click, you'll place these down. Um, this large vessel requires a whole spot to itself. And then we take straw, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we take eight logs as well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oop, place too many there. Again, it's the lag, unfortunately. So break this log real quick. And then we take our fire starter and we just light that on fire and let it burn. And then when it stops burning, we will have our pottery. So let's just grab up some more straw. There is a zombie over there. Let's turn these guys into spears and get a second one out. Or javelins. Now, I can throw these. And actually, I believe... Yeah, they do more damage when I throw them at full. Um, do we have any more grass? Or is that all of our... I think that's all of our fully grown grass. Fully grown grass? My tongue didn't want to work there for a second. Unfortunately, that's a bummer. Um, let's see if we can't get any saplings. Well, that's another bummer. So you don't just want to break... Um, just cut these trees down. Because when you chop these trees down, you just go to the bottom one. Um, it will chop through, use up the durability that it will take to cut down the whole tree. Um, give you all the logs like that um, but if you do that you lose everything in the leaves so you don't get any sticks you don't get any saplings so if you need that stuff you need to be careful and not just chop down the whole tree um, and it looks like I'm not going to get anything from down here we have some more sand, so we can go up a little lot higher. And our sand fell. Of course it did. Come on. Up. And nothing. Well, that's unfortunate. Let's get our axe out and chop this tree down. Or mo chop most of it down. Chop, 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 chop. Come on. Oh, there we go. Um, now with logs, there's also a thing you can do. If you shift, right click, you get these, which you can then throw a whole bunch of logs in. 
which is nice, a good way to store logs. Um, as you can see, we only have a 2x2 two two crafting window. Um, this is because we can't, this means we can't just craft whatever we want. And it's not easy to make a crafting table either. Um, oh yeah. If you right click while it's empty, it will blow air, which is a nice thing. It's interesting. Day is coming though, which is nice. Um, that's still burning, but we can come over here and we can grab some grass, which is what we need. To get this other one going. Go away! Go away! There we go. He's dead. Nice. Um, I do have a bit of rotten flesh, but I can't really do anything with it right now. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then wood. Eight. Start this on fire, and then in order to make a new um, fire starter, it's just two sticks. Pretty simple. Um, so those will burn. We actually need more clay, and I want to grow more trees over here, but we don't have any saplings, which is a problem. Uh, but we have sugar cane, which I can't really do anything with right now. Just makes paper and then make stuff. So yeah, terraformer craft is obviously a the main thing here, but there's also things like immersive engineering. Um, if I just scroll through any eye a little bit, um, maybe it'll show me other stuff. Yeah, we got a bunch of other things as well. So it's not just primitive Stone Age stuff. Um, like if we open up this book, we got the Stone Age, we got casting, Iron Age, immersive engineering, factory, mechanism, open computers, loads of stuff. All right, so a hide bed means we need a thatch and we need a large raw hide that we get from hunting animals. So we're gonna have to go hunting. Still waiting on that stuff. All right, so um. I think it's probably a good spot to end the episode. Um, I think, yeah, we're going to go on with this, see how it goes, see if I end up dead anytime soon. Um, oh, one more quick thing before I go things is we have these other things. We have inventory, we have our skills, which right now we're a novice at everything. Um, but if we live long enough, we can get better at all these things. There's an actual, there's actual seasons. So we're in early summer right now. We need to make sure we get everything we need before winter. I've never actually been to a winter in this mod. Um, so that will be fun. And then we have our health. Um, depending on what kind of foods you eat, you will gain different um, things. Like, if you have a more varied diet, you'll have better health. The longer you live, you get more health. So, basically, surviving and doing well, um, you get more stuff. So, um, I'm probably going to... I'm just going to... If my words would work. Um, I'm going to end this episode here. Um, probably grab a little bit more supplies and then... Um, yeah, we'll see what happens in the next episode. Um, yeah, there's still a lot of fire over there. But until then, guys, um, thank you all so much for watching and joining me on this new adventure. Um, I'm not sure when this is coming out, but I hope you guys are having a fantastic week, and I'll see you next time. Till then, guys, bye-bye.